in science. I'm not the greatest student in the world. I know some kids actually like school, but I honestly can't say I do. I like some part of school like PE and computer class and lunch and recess. But all in all, I'd be fine without school. The thing I hate the most about school is all the homework we get. It's not enough that we have to sit through class after class and try to stay awake while they feel our heads with all this stuff we will probably never need to know, like how to figure out the surface area of the cube or what the difference is between kinetic and potential energy. I'm like, who cares? I've never ever heard my parents say the world kinetic in my entire life. I hate science the most out of all my classes. We get so much work it it's not even funny. And teacher Mr. Rub Miss Rubin is so strict about everything. Even the way we write our handings on top of our papers. I once got two points off a homework assignment because I didn't put the date on top for any stuff. When me and August were still friends, I was go doing okay in science because August sat next to me and always let me copy his notes. August has the neatest handwriting of anybody I've ever seen who's a boy. Even his script is neat, up and down perfectly with really small round the loopy letters but now that we're ex friends it's bad because I can't ask him to let me copy his notes anymore. So I was kind of scrambling today, trying to take notes about what Mr. Robin was saying. My handwriting is awful when all of a sudden she started talking about fifth grade science for your project how we all had to choose a science project to work on. While she was saying this, I was thinking, we just finished the freaking Egypt project. Now we have to start a whole new thing. And then in my head, I was going, oh no, like the kid named Home Alone with the mouth hanging open and his hand on his face. That was the face I was making on the inside. And then I thought of those pictures of melting ghost faces I've seen any somewhere where the mouths were open wide and they're screaming. And then all of a sudden the picture flew into my head. This memory and I knew what Summer had meant by bleeding scream. It's so weird how it all just came to me in this flash. Someone in homeroom had dressed up in the bleeding scream costume in, on Halloween. I remember seeing him a few deaths away from me. And then I remember not seeing him again. Oh man, it was August. All of this hit me in science class while the teacher were talking. Oh man. I'd been talking to Julian about August. Oh man. Now I understood. I was so mean. I don't even know why. I'm not even sure what I said. But it was bad. It was only a minute or two. It's just that I knew Julian and everybody thought I was so weird for hanging out with August all the time. I felt stupid and I don't know why I said that stuff. I just was going along. Along. I was stupid. I'm stupid. Oh God. He was supposed to come as Boba Fett. I would never ha have said that stuff in front of Boba Fett, but that was him. That bleeding scream sitting on the desk looking over at us. The long white mask with the fake squirting blood. The mouth open wide like the ghoul was crying. That was him. I felt like I was going to puke.